The police say they've now found the person who owns that fire engine and they're warning they're not supposed to drive around without the right licensing. KCRA 3's Michelle Bandour joins us with the details. Michelle, you spoke with someone who saw this fire truck. What did they see? Uh, well, I did, Ty. Actually, we talked to a Wilton man who was driving by and he recorded it with his cell phone. He actually drove by first and thought this is unusual and then came back around to get more video. He saw two men not wearing firefighting gear, not wearing helmets, actually on top of that fire truck spraying water. Now, he gave us that video, so check this out. This is what he recorded while he was driving by. Tim Conklin says it just looked out of place to him in East Sacramento at Alhambra and W Street. The unmarked fire engine and the two men on top of it spraying water. He says at the same time, a real fire engine with sirens raced by their car and that fire truck that was in question. Sacramento Fire says now it's not illegal for someone to own a decommissioned fire truck, but Conklin says it was just odd and he wondered what they were doing and why they were doing that. Sacramento police did say that members, officers with the traffic enforcement team actually found the men that actually own that fire truck today and they let them know that they do need the proper licenses and that emergency vehicle equipment like that those violations have to be corrected before they can legally drive it on the roadway. But again, this just raised a lot of questions from people who saw them spraying that water from Tim Conklin, who recorded the video, just wondering what they were doing and why they were doing and why they own a fire truck. Reporting live in East Sacramento, Michelle Bandour, KCRA 3 News. It's all very interesting. Thanks for following up on that story, Michelle.